We've just downloaded this rear-wheel drive GATM3 and it's made a very healthy 542 horsepower and 525 foot-pounds of torque. The customer is having lots of parts, so stage two with catless downpipes, OPF delete, even chewy intake, and a whole host of visual mods. So let's get it back to the workshop and see what we're going to be doing to this car. We're back in the workshop and we have all the parts laid out and let's have a look at what we're going to be fitting to this beautiful signal green G80 M3. We have the Eventuri intake, Eventuri engine cover, auto ID front lip, evolved down pipes, a full Remus exhaust system, KW has kit, and to finish off the rear end, an auto ID rear spoiler. We also have a CSL style carbon grill, but that hasn't arrived yet. One thing we, we can't lay out on the floor is the stage two software, but we will show you that on the dyno once it's been applied. Now there's lots of parts here, it's time to stop talking and get them fitted.
With the car tuned, we can now take a look at the results. So we made 543 horsepower and 527 foot pound of torque, completely stock form. With just the hardware modifications, which are Evolve Catless Downpipe, Remus Full Exhaust and even Shuri Intake, we made 557 horsepower and 544 foot pound of torque. And with our stage two tune, we've made 680 horsepower and 636 foot pound of torque, which is a really good result. You can see it's making a lot of torque throughout the rev range and we're over 650 horsepower from around five and a half thousand right till red line so that will make this a very quick car remember this car is running on 99 octane fuel that's it for this beautiful signal green ga em3 it's a little bit different to when it first came into us it's lower louder looks a lot different and now it's certainly faster thank you so much for watching guys if you like the video please give us a thumbs up and if you haven't already please remember to subscribe to the channel and turn your notifications on if you want to join the conversation, please drop us a comment below and we will do our best to respond to you. And if you're running out of things to watch, why don't you watch one of these two?